Uh, yeah, I suppose it, it was a lot. The, there wasn't a lot, and there was a lot to like about it. You know, we, we uh, turned over a lot of ball, and, and we you know, given plenty of chances at us. Um, mm. Defensively, I was, I was very happy. You know, we kept. Uh, they scored most of their points from kicks. You know, that'll happen, but you know we're, we're giving them the field position to put those attacking kicks in. So, uh, yeah, I thought structurally, defensively, we're good. Um, yeah, turnovers. You know, it's been a problem through the trials, and it's you know been a problem for most sides. I've watched most games this year. Well, last night and through the trials, and it, it has been a problem for for just about all sides. Is there any reason for that? How do you why? Um, yeah, I suppose there's theories on it, but it, it, it's. Generally, at the start of the year, we, we talk about ball control, and, and if you can hang on to the ball, you win. And uh, so, it probably didn't work that way today because you know they just probably completed. I know at half time they had a lot more ball than or completed, got to their kick a lot more. So, well, yeah, a bit rusty, I suppose, ring rusty, and, and uh, you know everyone's fresh, and, and there's plenty of line speed out there, a lot of, lot of good contact, and it was a slippery day, so that, that all adds to it. How crucial was it to get that try just before half time? Yeah, well, definitely, we, we came into the shed in a good frame of mind. You know, we, we, we didn't play well. Um, and, yeah, but I suppose it's the whole basis of your footy, you know. If you if you can hang on to the ball, no matter what you do on the ball, if you can hang on to it, um, you, you know, you stop the other side from scoring. And we just kept giving them a chance to score. So to be able to come in, only six points down. Um, yeah, and at that at that stage of the game, it was, uh, it was important that we came in on a high, you know. Six points is a, is a huge, major difference to 12 points. I'm guessing that Presto's little kick off was, a, was his own idea. Yeah, yeah, he, he never put uh, shackles on Presto. He, he, um, I think he's only ever done that two or three times, and, he, and he gets, he's come away with a result every single time. What about his contribution today? There's probably four big places in the strip on one of the the try that he scored, the, the kick opportunity he does, those little mm. things have turned up. Yeah, just very instinctive, you know. He's as, as good as anyone I've seen at that. He, he, you know, people can say it's luck or whatever, but it's it's not luck because he, he continues to do it. You know, he just bobs up, you know, in the right area, and uh, you know, I think he does it best from fullback. How is he after that knock to the head? Yeah, it's a bit of a concern because he's he's had a history of uh, of head knocks, not so much last year, but the year before we had a, a run of them. So the docs uh, keep a close eye on him. Um, you know, probably the first 48 hours, 48 hours will tell whether he'll play on next weekend. Uh, hopefully just cramped up. He was a bit tight in the, in the carbs. Um, so hopefully just a cramp. I don't think there's any strain there. No, we'll have to wait until he cools down. But hopefully just a, a cramp. He, it wasn't one of his best games, you know. He... he uh, like Bertie's a ball player and he, and he and he goes hard at the line, so he's gonna you know he's gonna make a mistake now and then. It wasn't the conditions to suit him, but what I liked about it was uh, how he reacted to it. You know, I don't think I've seen um, an aggression in defence like he brings you know in our, in my time here. So it's um, guys like that you know they as long as they they never do a wonder but they go hard. You know he's very similar to Preston. You know you you have, you have your good and your bad days, but it's, it's how you uh, how you turn up after it and. Whilst Birdie made a few errors of the ball, he, he really shortened a few of them up at, at crucial times. First game, first game Nick Carter, do you think maybe he's just trying a bit too hard or, you know, rather than the other way around? But... Yeah, it, well, mate, he's very competitive, you know, he just, he, he likes, he, he does just try, you know, pr- basically he did, he, he tried too hard. Um, but, that, you know, he's, I've watched him for a while and, he, and he's he does that regardless, you know, he's a, he's a footballer, he likes to uh, play attacking football and... Uh, I suppose you know we just got to harness it. Uh, but like I say, I, I don't really mind because you know, you know his next effort's going to be better than the one before. What was um, something up, Katie? What was the most pleasing thing that you were looking for that you got? Oh, we don't. We're a bit worried in the rain. We don't normally play that well in the wet, and um, we don't play often. We don't play all that good coming from behind either. So. We did both of them things today, and you know we, we didn't play well statistically, but you know there was something there that um, we kept held them out in the second half, uh, and we come up with points, you know exactly when we needed them. And um, you know I don't think that's lucky all, all the time. You know I think if you if you got a building aside, uh, that tends to happen more than it doesn't. You know and that that was probably the most pleasing thing. John, you're impressed with uh, Matt Rogers' his defence there. He had a couple of big plays in, in defence, and particularly that last one, he knocked the ball down before, I think, Friendy put the kick 
Yeah, the urgency in defence was great from our, uh, you know, they threatened us a lot, um, you know, outside our, our tight men and they, they did a great job, you know, their, their urgency um, and their decision making was, you know, the best I've seen it, you know, often when you come out of the line it's a risky play but every time they did it they come up with the money so that was, you know, that was very pleasing. Is there, is there a lot of more pressure on you guys to succeed this year because, you know, all us guys and everyone is talking up that, you know, you'd like to go better than... Not, not really. You know, I, I don't think any of we don't talk about it in house. You know, I, I think um, I think the boys expect to to improve on last year. So that's you know, I suppose that that goes with the territory. But uh, no, I, I don't think they they feel it because it's in the paper. I think they feel it because they had a pretty good year last year and they want to do better.